Hi everybody, um, I'm here on the booth of the HDMI licensing company um, on the IFA show 2011 in Berlin. Um, sitting next to me is Steve Minuti, the president of HDMI company and I want to ask him some general questions about HDMI of the technology uh, respectively um, about HDMI cables. Uh, welcome Steve. Thank you, thank you for having me. Um, Steve, everybody is talking about HDMI. HDMI is on everybody's lips, uh, but it seems to me that people often don't know about the technology that's behind it. Um, um, some people don't know the difference between a normal standard video cable or audio cable and an HDMI cable. Uh, could you give us, uh, with a few words, a short definition of HDMI, what it means, how it works? Sure, the HDMI uh, stands for High Definition Multimedia Interface. And what that really means is we saw that your content was digital, your displays were digital, but we consistently had an analog connection. And what that meant was you were not getting the highest quality uh, and you were converting from digital to analog and reconverting back to digital. Uh, and so what we knew was going to be important was to create a digital link between your source and your display. That's what HDMI is, and what that allows you to do is send very fast data, and that means there's no compression, it's the highest quality, uh, and with HDMI, you've got all of your video and all of your audio over one single cable. So it made it very convenient, highest quality cable. Okay, and uh, if people want to buy an HDMI cable, what are the, the key features they have to look for? Um, what is the most important feature for an a HDMI cable? Well, you've got to know, there's really not that much to know, but you've got to know what you want to power, basically. Uh, it comes in two speeds, standard and high speed. Mm -hmm. Now, the vast majority of people now are buying high speed, the vast majority of products on the market are high speed, I would recommend always buying high speed. High speed allows you to do 1080p or 3D or in the future 4K by 2K. It's the fastest you can buy and there's very little price difference really, so look for high speed. Then you really have a choice of whether you want this Ethernet channel or not and that really depends on whether your products are taking advantage of the Ethernet mm -hmm. channel. So high speed with or without Ethernet depending on your, okay. your need. And um, how about the version numbers uh, we often hear about, uh, like uh, 1.3 or now actually 1.4? Is it really relevant for cables also or is it only for devices? Well, the version numbers are not even allowed anymore in terms of the way people talk about cables because it can be very confusing. The version numbers are, are our own internal way of keeping track of all the new features in a particular version of the specification. But it really doesn't translate easily to what a cable can do or even what a TV can do. So that's why we recommend you look for the high speed, standard, with or without ethernet, that's all you need to know. Okay. Uh, and version numbers, really, you should never look for the features you okay. like. And the cable that supports those features, okay. never worry about version numbers. Okay. And, um, of course, everybody's also talking about 3D. Yeah, here on the iFi show, uh, many uh, sh industry are showing 3D televisions and stuff like that. Um, do I need a special cable for 3D transmitting, or does every HDMI cable transmit uh, 3D data? So any HDMI cable that's high speed will do any 3D transmission now and even into the future when you have absolutely 1080p right left eye, which is twice as much bandwidth, high-speed cables will do that. Okay. Um, another question. In April uh, 2011, this year, you launched a, a new program called um, HDMI-proofed associate program. Um, can you tell us more about the program, uh, more about the idea that's behind that program? So, especially in the world of cables, it's not so much a, a problem with TVs or Blu-ray players, but with cables, there are so many people making cables. Names you've never heard of. Uh, Is that inacoustic? <laughs> not, not all names you've never heard of, but very many different names. How do you tell which cable to buy? How do you tell who's making the cable that's been tested, that's bought from an approved... Every, every product that, that uses HDMI has to be uh, built by someone who's licensed, mm -hmm. right? Otherwise, they're not tested and you just don't know the quality. So it's especially problematic in the cable uh, world because you see on online there are so many cheap cables out there. Mm -hmm. So how do you know what to buy? Well, 
what we did was we, we said there are many people who are doing it the right way mm -hmm. in acoustics mm -hmm. one, um, and we want to sh we want to be to let them prove that they're doing it the right way. So we asked these companies to show us HDMI licensing that you're buying from adopters we call them, but licensees, people who are approved, that they've been tested, and that these products are, are completely compliant with the specification. If you can do that, then we give you a, a stamp of approval that says you're an approved reseller. Which you can see on the packaging. Yeah, so of course, right yeah. here, that stamp is only for companies that have gone through that program and said, these are tested, okay. these this are compliant, compliant. And, uh, and so you can be assured these things work. Okay. Uh, do you have uh, already any feedback from customers uh, concerning the program? Well, customers love it because okay. it gives them a level of security and comfort that, all right, I can, I can use this as a way of deciding who to buy from. Okay. And, and retailers love it too mm -hmm. because retailers can say, all right, I can buy, I can sell a product that I'm confident is, is legal okay. and compliant. Very interesting. Steve, thank you for taking the time answering some questions. I think um, we heard a lot about uh, interesting facts uh, concerning HDMI, um, which may help you to find the right cable. Um, and when you want to uh, get some more information, just visit our website uh, inacoustic.de or hdmi.org um, or visit us on Facebook. Um, thank you for watching and uh, Steve, I wish you a very successful show. For the thank you very much days. for having me. Thank Glad you. to do this.